<laughs> Shall we commence? You've improved quite a bit, but you still haven't become a true fighter. The real training starts now. Behind you! I couldn't see you. You were moving too fast. Your eyes will lie. Try to feel it. But I, I did feel it. That's the problem. From now on, whenever you're not eating or sleeping, you're fighting with me. Oh, no way! I'll die for sure! Then get stronger! Stronger than me. Stronger than the Saiyans who'll be here in six months. Take this! Well, it seemed that the last six months have wrung the crybaby out of you, at least. <laughs> yeah, but my dad used to tell me, he said, ever since you were reborn, you're not nearly as bad as you used to be. He said, now you're more grumpy than evil. <laughs> I think he was kind of right, but I mean, my mom is still totally scared of you and all. Stop blabbering and go to sleep. If you think today's training was hard, wait till you get a load of what I got in store for you tomorrow. Um, yes, sir. Impudent little brat. Huh? Uh. 
Something is on the way, and whatever it is, its power level exceeds 5,000. Nappa! Enough! Playtime is over! Eliminate them, now! We can't risk having all four team up on us! No! Piccolo! Let me! You just get out of there, and I'll find a way to keep this guy busy while we wait for Dad! <laughs> now what kind of nonsense is that? Do you expect me to let you go head to head with this oaf all on your own? Keep me busy, huh? <laughs> if that's what the brat wants, let's go! Damn it! <laughs> what? Now, now you're through. Die. <gasps> Gohan! Look for it! Gohan... You're the only person... I've ever known... who didn't treat me like... a monster. Piccolo, no! Just hold on! Please don't die! <clears throat> thank... Thank you... Uh, Gohan... If I'd known that merging with another being could result in this kind of power, I'd have sought it out years ago. It's Piccolo! Sorry to keep you waiting. So that's Frieza. I see. He's even more hideous than I imagined. Yet another Namekian who escaped my attention. This one is far more imposing than the others. No matter, he will soon join the rest of his kind in oblivion. You're a slippery one! Vengeance in the name of all the Namekians you slaughtered! Ah! 
should consider this in honor. You will be the first ones to ever lay eyes upon me in this next state. Prepare yourself and behold! What do you think was it worth the wait? Now, if you're ready, let's begin round two, shall we? Sorry to make you wait. Hope you're at peace! Cannon! You are such an eyesore. That was too close. Ah. Well, this has all been fun. Playtime is over. Dodge this. Damn it! I'm in real trouble now! What happened to all that energy you had a moment ago? Is that tiny reservoir of strength all dried up now? I can't take this anymore! Dad needs our help! I'm going in! Wait a minute! I think he's got something up his sleeve! A spirit bomb! Huh? A spirit bomb? Is that what I think it is? I, I've never seen a mass of energy that size. Freeze is wise to Goku's ploy. You two, listen up. Whatever happens, I forbid you to interfere in any way. Farewell. Hurry, finish that spirit bomb before he comes back. Th thanks, Piccolo. How is that Namekian still drawing breath? I thought they'd all been taken care of. I hate to rush you, but something tells me Freeze is losing his patience. Hurry! Launch it now! No! Not yet! Just a little bit longer! I miss it on all sides by sneaking parasitic flies! This is more than I can stand! <gasps> nice. With what little they had left, they put it to good use. Okay, it's finally ready! Do it! Yeah. What have you done? This is child's play! Your beastly tricks them! You dial! I will love!
Let's not waste any time. So these are the fearsome androids, huh? Not quite the monsters I'd imagined. Huh? Go on, you see it too, right? Yeah, right! It seems this technique is rushed for some reason. Fights just started and Goku's wasting most of his power. That... and his technique is sloppy. He's usually not this sloppy. If he was fighting at his full capability, this android would already be a pile of scrap. <laughs> no calling your comrades now. Your energy will be all mine. Gohan, come to me quickly. The android is... Yes, you're almost completely sapped of power. In a few more seconds, you'll be dead. What? There's no way he could have found us so quickly! Vegeta, back off! He's mine! Don't interfere, he says. <laughs> Excellent! He's handing me another opportunity to absorb his strength. And the second I do... What are you whimpering about over there, huh? Sorry to make you wait. Hope you're at peace. Special beam cannon! I'll find you. Prepare yourself. Useless. Come meet 
your due. It's over. Justice. Dodge this. Now, you tell me what kind of creature you are. Make it quick. Talk or else. I try to make a habit of not talking to my food. Before you add me to your collection, you are at least going to tell me this. What sort of abomination are you? My name is Cell. I am an android. I was created by the computer in Dr. Giraud's secret laboratory. That lunatic again, huh? Years ago, Dr. Giraud began collecting cell samples from the world's greatest fighters, hoping to synthesize their DNA and create the ultimate android. However, I cannot become truly perfect until I have absorbed two highly specialized life forms. And what sort of specialized life forms are you talking about? The ones I need are two of Dr. Giraud's other creations, Android 17 and 18. And once I achieve my perfect form, I will be invincible! The greatest power the universe has ever known! Alright. I've heard plenty. That's everything I need to know. You... You tricked me! It was all a ploy to get me to talk! Now that I know what you are, I know how to stop you.
Well, here I am. Go ahead, show me what you've got. What? You're finished! What? Looks like you're all out of moves, android! Nice try, but still not enough. <laughs> you wait, I'm still just getting started. Don't expect me to go easy on you this time. Fight with everything you've got! Damn, that cell. I was so caught up in the battle, I didn't sense him coming. Okay, now who is this freak? Yes, fine. There they are. A feast for the eyes. The two androids that I will absorb to complete my design and realize my perfect form. Not so fast. Your fight is with me! Light grenade! Is that... Gohan?
Let's not waste any time. Don't underestimate Earth! with a bang! <laughs> Don't underestimate me. Got you! Fear not. 
This'll be over quick. Let's not waste any time. If I'd known that merging with another being could result in this kind of power, I'd have sought it out years ago. Sorry to keep you waiting. So that's Frieza. I see. He's even more hideous than I imagined. Yet another Namekian who escaped my attention. This one is far more imposing than the others. No matter, he will soon join the rest of his kind in oblivion. One. Why you? Now I will have vengeance in the name of all the Namekian Jews slaughtered. Why you? <laughs> <laughs> It's over. Don't get carried away. Over here. Over here. You scum should consider this in honor. You will be the first ones to ever lay eyes upon me in this next state. Prepare yourself and behold! What do you think was it worth the wait? Now, if you're ready, let's begin round two, shall we? I have to admit, you are putting on a much better showing than I would have given you credit for. Now I will show you a nightmare beyond the horrors of hell. He's got some terrifying power, but I'm not backing down. No way in hell! A halfway decent plan! The fact 
that you've actually caused me the tiniest bit of damage. I have to commend you. True. I'm barely able to put up a fight. Cuckoo, where are you? Hope you're at peace. Special Beam Cannon! Don't you mock me! You should be proud as the last remaining Namekian to oppose me. But in a few moments, you will join the rest of your kin. Goku's energy was at a level I've never felt before. I should have been able to do better in that last battle. Let's not waste any time. Well, here I am. Go ahead, show me what you've got. What? You're finished! What? Looks like you're all out of moves, Android! Nice try, but still not enough. <laughs> you wait, I'm still just getting started. Don't expect me to go easy on you this time. <laughs> Now who is this freak? Yes, finally. There they are. A feast for the eyes. The two androids that I will absorb to complete my design and realize my perfect form. Not so fast. Your fight is with me! You're less than dirt. Be gone! Hell's a grenade! <laughs> There's no escaping me. You... You've got to be kidding! <laughs> well, that removes the unwanted interruption. So where were we? Perfect. Then let's finish this. 
this'll shut you up. Ha ha ha! Fight with everything you got! Yeah! I've won this 17! <laughs> I can't believe that someone like you could actually put up a fight against Seventeen. Consider this a warning. If you three continue to try hurting Goku, I'll be there to stand in your way every time. <laughs> Too many annoying interruptions today anyway. We'll pick up the Goku hunt another time. Sixteen. Eighteen. We're out of here. Mr. Piccolo! You were incredible! You drove off the androids all by yourself! You really saved my skin. If I had to fight him now, I wouldn't have stood a chance. I'll take him on next time. <laughs> yeah, this battle definitely isn't over quite yet. They'll be back to come after you again. So you better be ready. And Gohan, let's keep up your training as well. Yeah! Thanks to Piccolo's efforts, the Red Ribbon Androids made a temporary retreat. But more importantly, Cell had been vanquished. The Namekian warrior continues his training with Gohan in preparation for their next great battle. Let's not waste any time. So these are the fearsome androids, huh? Not quite the monsters I'd imagined. Huh? Go on, you see it too, right? Yeah, right! It seems his technique is rushed for some reason. Fights just started and Goku's wasting most of his power. That and his technique is sloppy. That's it. I'm stepping in. Mr. Piccolo? Piccolo! That's enough! Fall back, Goku! This enemy's mine! Do you actually think you can defeat us? Don't believe me? The results of my last three years of training are about to show you! Don't 
Vegeta! Andra 20 got away. Hey, Goku! What's your condition? Seems like the heart virus hasn't kicked in as we were expecting. Yeah, but I can feel it setting in for sure. It was stupid of you not to bring the medicine in case this happened. At the very least, you should rest yourself. I'll swing by your place to pick up that medicine. In the meantime, why don't you head for Master Roshi's place and take it easy, okay, Goku? Thanks, Yamcha. And sorry for all the trouble. We'll keep up the pursuit of Android 20. Well, as much as I hate following Giro's orders, the idea of us standing around here doing nothing all day is driving me up the wall. I'll handle this. Come on. Just so you know, I won't be holding back. They're strong, but I can take them. If I had to choose between going into battle alongside the Namekian, the Earthlings, or Kakarot, I'd fight and die alone before accepting help from them! Beautiful speech. You know what? I would have gotten bored just watching anyway. So I'll jump in and we'll have a nice little two-on-two. -two. Have it your way. Like I'm fighting you. I better watch myself. than I thought. These androids show no sign of exhaustion at all. Stamina or what? Mr. Piccolo, let me fight alongside
Gohan's hidden potential is starting to come to the surface. If we combine our strength, we'd be a force to be reckoned with. The virus is getting worse, isn't it? Yeah, but I can only take the medicine once it's completely infected me. Till I beat this thing, I'm not gonna be all that useful in combat. They're way stronger than we thought. Three years training wasn't enough, so the only way we're gonna stand a chance now is to train some more. Piccolo, I had wanted to train with Gohan in the hyperbolic time chamber, but... Would you go and train with him in my place? He has so much potential. I know you could bring out his latent power. But, but Dad, you're sure I have a power like that within me? Go on. Listen to me. I know you do. And I know you can feel it. You've already gotten so strong with your training as it is. Think of how much further you could go! <laughs> the hyperbolic time chamber, huh? Alright, sounds like a good plan. But this training won't be exclusively for Gohan's benefit. I want to make sure that I too could keep holding my own in this battle. Mr. Piccolo, that sounds great! I'll work really hard! and 18. I found you at last! Ready to be absorbed. <laughs> what do you think? Absorbing that android made him stronger. Go on. We need to buy some more time. Okay. Understood. Energy. My body feels heavy, and it's so hot I can barely breathe. We have to be in here for a whole year? We have all the food and drink we need. It's the perfect environment to focus on training. So what kind of training are we going to be doing? 
More than anything, we need you to be able to become a Super Saiyan like your father. Then you need to go further beyond even that. But first, I'll be focusing on sharpening the parts of your skill set that are still a bit rough around the edges. Got it? Where should we start? You have a latent power that surpasses even Goku's strength. But you need a lot more combat experience in order to draw it out. In this fight, I'm going to come at you with killing intent. You need to defend yourself as if your life depends on it. So we're going no holds barred? If that's what it takes! I get that you don't have a passion for fighting. And that's all well and good. But your pacifism won't mean squat if the world gets destroyed. Now come on. You need to take this seriously or you'll get hurt. Yes, sir! Over here, think back to your previous enemies. Right. Those past battles. I couldn't protect everyone. I have to draw out my power. You're less than dirt. Be gone! Hell's a grenade! <laughs> There's no escaping me. Whoa! Uh, I got a ways to go! Not a bad start. Don't forget how that feels. So, who will be going up against me first? Will it be Goku? Ooh, or perhaps Vegeta? I know damn well how powerful Cell has become in his perfect form, even before the fight's begun. But this is what I've trained for. Cell, I am prepared to be your first opponent. What? Mr. Piccolo, are you sure? Final Piccolo. He's got a plan in mind. So I say we let him do his thing! I'll give it all I've got. Even if there's only the slightest chance of winning. My, my. This is a delightful surprise. Piccolo! But I'm in a gracious mood, so I'll allow you to show me your progress. Good. The training I've endured all this time has been for the sole purpose of taking you down. So let's go! So go on then, show me everything you can do. Damn it. Over here. Goodness! The surprises just keep on coming! You're definitely strong. But... You're less than dirt! Run! 
Be gone! Hell zone grenade! Interesting. Your improvements are actually quite remarkable. Unfortunately, there's still not enough to surpass mine. Let's go! Over here! Over here! Light grenade! <laughs> Don't get too relaxed. Oh, okay. I'll start taking this seriously then. Come on! I thought you were ready to fight me! Or are you just ready to surrender? <laughs> He's... he's gonna kill Mr. Piccolo! Stop it! Stop! Now that's some energy! Fantastic! I do believe my next opponent has already been decided. We're not done! <laughs> Actually, we are. Leave him alone! What are you doing? Finish him! It's all up to you! What, do you want me to end it already? <laughs> I'm not letting him off that easy. He deserves to feel the same pain he put all his victims through. <laughs> Stay calm! I'm fine, see? No, Mr. Piccolo. For all the horrible things he's done, to you and the others, he needs to pay before I kill him. Listen, remember your training. Remember why you continue to fight. For your family, your friends, to protect the Earth. You're right. Forgive me, Mr. Piccolo. Cell, I think you understand how much stronger I am than you. So carrying on with this fight is pointless. Will you surrender? What's wrong? Where did all that confidence disappear to? No! He's become more powerful than ever! <laughs> now it's my turn to torture you before I kill you! <laughs> You. Oh, for the love of... Have you still not realized that I'm done with you? Stand aside or die! 
I told you I wasn't done. This is still my fight, too. Gohan, I'll buy you some time. Rest until you're ready to finish him. <sighs> right! You won't survive this time. You're buying some time, are you? <laughs> How much? Maybe a few measly seconds? You won't survive this time. Planet and wipe you all out at once. He's wide open. A special beam cannon might work on him now. Light grenade! Hope you're at peace. Be gone. I have. energy. She could actually beat Cell. I don't think so. <clears throat> no good. Their power's evenly matched, so I'd better tip the scale. See you in hell! <laughs> no! Over? Go on, you're alive! Yeah, I'm okay. But I was a fool. I didn't finish Cell when I had the chance, and now Dad... No, don't blame yourself. Even if Goku had been fighting in your place, things likely would have gone the same. You two are so alike, it's hilarious. What you share isn't being naive. It's compassion for even your worst enemies. And it's because of that compassion that I'm still alive to this day. Mr. Piccolo! Gohan, be proud of the man you are. Your kindness isn't a weakness. In fact, it's your greatest strength. Someday, 
I want to become just as strong as you and Dad, Mr. Piccolo. Will you help me? Wow. You grow up fast, kid. Thank you. 